What's up, guys? It's Quad Touch. Holy crap, like first live, but wait now. First, first, first Quad Touch clip of Kale without hair. True. 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 I still have my hair, it's just in a man bun. And we're gonna go pick up Ty right now. And I have the gifts for, for, for. It's, it's, a, it's a vinyl of Lone. And he, he, he never guessed, he never, he, there's no way he knew that. He would have never known that that's what it was. He would have never known. Would have never known that. Yes, I told you. <laughs> I also, yeah, I also told you. And then Ty's is is Death Dynamic Shroud. What do you think of that? Shroud like the shroom. Death Dynamic Shroud. Shroud like the shroom. Shrooms. Like Siesta. Shroud. Oh, Shroud. I think it's shrooms. I was like, what? With the JPEG Mafia, here comes Ty. That's not JPEG Mafia. That's Tyler. Why well, no? We're like the song playing. <laughs> oh, I'm off at art. <laughs> <laughs> Got some JPEG Mafia playing. <laughs> present! Present! Rap. You got me present! Guys, Ty? Guys, my yeah. present. Merry Christmas. Oh, Is that for me? Look. <laughs> 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 Hi, where are we going? Yeah. In what state? <laughs> I'm here. Washington. Lanny the Teddy. There's only one place that Seattle Listening to Tyler. He's not gonna focus. Where are we headed to? I don't know. We're headed to Easy I'm Street. Lost. Easy Street Records in Seattle, Washington, Easy right? Easy Street Records. Easy Street I'm Records. Pretty sure pretty pretty look at says. my shirt. My shirt literally shirt, says shirt, shirt. Easy Street. Street. Yeah, see. See? Tyler the Creatives. We're heading there. We're heading there right I, I, I now. I think he has. Has he put call me if you get lost? You just split the pole. You just split the pole. Bad luck. And what'd you get? I, I, got, uh, I got two things. Uh, here in my face. So, uh, if you're like, I guess like more around the uh, like Kenny Beats, uh, Mac DeMarco, yeah. all those people, you would know uh, Kenny, uh, call me a DJ Beck, uh, JD Beck. Nice. It's a really good album. It has a lot of features on it. What? Thundercat, Mac DeMarco, Herbie Hancock, Anderson Pack, Soup Dog, Buster Rhymes, Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg is on this album. Nice. And then the big boy. The, the big one. one. This is the big guy. I want to bring. Yeah. Some. Hello. Let's see. We're all Duster down. Contemporary Movement. Nice. That's where we are. That's where we are. That's baby. where we are right now at Seattle, where that airport would usually be. That I go to. That, I'm good. Uh, next time when uh, I go up there. Next time when I go there, I'm going. I'm bringing this just to take a photo. All right. This is for me. A bunch of records. Yeah. So. Yeah. This is what I heard. Really big. Got some record sleeves. Oh yeah. No. You got some so record sleeves. And then this is. I didn't expect to find this at all. Like where I went. But um. I found Neo Wax Bloom by Igloo Ghost. You like to vinyl. explain what's on it? Um. Or is it just some, all all it's, original? It's uh. Okay. So Neo Wax Bloom. I'm gonna be honest. I don't listen to the album. I haven't listened to the album that much. But I do know that Igloo Ghost produced all of um Milo's. Uh, what's it called? All of Milo's album, uh, Toothpaste Suburb, and then I also listened to, um, I think it was Clear Tammy, Clear, Clear Tammy, Tammy, I don't know how to say it, Clear Tammy, and I was like, okay, yeah, I'll pick it up. It's, it's, it's like the album, it's probably good, so I'm gonna pick it up. I got it, and I'm awesome. And then, Ty, what did you get? Hold on, hold on. <laughs> He's <laughs> still, still He's like busy. waiting. Tyler Postry, can't we see it, because you can see a small little image in the plastic. It's, uh, what's the lyrics? Um, lyrics to what? I forget, it's to Wolf. Glam. Glam. It just says glam lyrics. It just says glam lyrics. And then, get on the phone. On the phone right now. Thank you, Gail, for being a kind gentleman. Bruno Mar! Bruno Mar! For my mom. Not for me. Mom. She liked this album. And I liked it when I was a little baby. So you got that shit. For my mom. And then poster for me. <laughs> Not for you. Not for you. But yeah, that's. 
those are our purchases. That was that was that was uh, record store. We went to one. Easy Street. It was story one. one. Yeah, Easy Street. It was one. I really easy. It was really easy. I didn't get to record inside because it was freaking packed in there, and we were just trying to we were spending more time trying to find our way around. I, I, but next we're gonna go to another store, and I'll record in that one probably because we're, oh, we're we're going we're going to a really big store next. So it's gonna be big and epic, and I'm gonna be able to record. Transition. Wow. How we get? How we get mean? We've made it to the silver platters and look at this. I'm oh my gosh. I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm so we're here on silver platters right now. We're gonna look through some vinyl with Ty Gaming King Crimson. and Crump Kale. Isn't that, isn't that King Crimson like album like a leak one? So, uh, no, it's not really expensive, but it's King Crimson up there. Big money. Big money. There's Kale. We're gonna look at Walking over here, I saw something did a whole 180 like that and it went away. Is that pretty good? What? Okay. That kind of looks. Oh wait, though. <gasps> can I have that? Yeah, one album. Good. One album. That's the one I want too. One album. Thirty-one ninety-nine. God damn. Um, I have the eraser now. And one yes, album. and. Van Halen. Okay. Yes, the and. Weezer. What Let's the heck? Check. It's always just the teal album. And then... Oh, nice. That's a good one. Okay, I'm gonna keep looking around. Now. It'd be funny if you just like jump cut to this with, with just like the beginning of like like the. It just. Right. What does he have? What does he have? Jesus, but with a Y. Oh man. Jesus. Look at this tribe. Oh! He made Jesus. He made Jesus. He, he made Jesus. Please. Please. Yes! Yes! Look at this. The tribe, tribe, down here. Do they have Midnight Marauders? Yeah, midnight oh. Marauders? No Midnight Marauders. Sorry. No L's. No Death Grips. What about Death Grips? They have Death Gripping. Ooh, what? What? Why is he gripping Break? the death? It's kind of rude. What do they have? Let me get some Eminem. Eminem. Maybe it's like hey, it's right right thing. Hey, you're my way. Hey, you're my way. Hey. <laughs> Where's the gripping of death? Oh, there's DJ Shadow. They have, DJ Shadow. They have Zarmi, it's metal fan. It's pretty, pretty, pretty big one. Pretty big. Oh, pretty big I think maybe Death Grips is Drake. an experimental. Oh my gosh, what is Drake? Oh no, I think they're in, actually, I think God's they're in like rap. God's Flash! God's Flash! <laughs> Did you find? For me. I got Yes and I got the Eraser. This is the one I've been looking for all you see my reflection. All today. I've been looking for Gene Blunt Black Metal 2. I finally found Black Metal 2. I might get all three of these. How also. excited are you? One, two, five. One to five? Five right now. <gasps> Wait, soundtracks. You can look for um look for your old your um what's it called? The Team Fortress 2 soundtrack. It's got me in the oh, this is awesome. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's R. Um let's try it on the other side then. S. T. T. Team Fortress 2. All right, Ty, what did you get? Free promo CD. You got a free promo CD. I like weed. <laughs> I like weed. Yeah. All right, Ken, what did you get? So I got the very good. He got something really cool. It's raining. My right. man got Tricot. He got the. 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 He got the. I want to call it that the. That is the. Of course, it's all by itself. I got fucking hair all in the Check it here for me. I'm going to show off it's my album. It's I can't remember. Oh, so, guys. I got, I spent $91. I spent oh. a lot of money. Okay, get it. <laughs> $91. So I got, yes, and the self titled. I got Black Metal 2 by Dean Blunt. And then I got B Racer by Tom York. Wait, let's zoom in. Tom York, Tom York, Tom York. Funny, Tom York, Tom York. insert Tom York funny I, image. Dude, I came here to search for Anima, ended up getting the Racer because it has skip divided on it. And it has Black Swan. Insert you said Tom York. Word. Injured Tom York face, funny image face on Collins. <laughs> Tom York laughs funny. <laughs> me when Tom York, me when Tom York laughs, be laughing funny. And then, solitude, yeah, solitude. Jesse, you're on an album. Going. Jesse, why are you making weed? We need yeah, weed. Like Jesse, Jesse. We decided to feast. We are feasting now. How's this feast going? Guacamole. <laughs> yeah. We got this nice guacamole plate. Mm hmm. How, how's your feast? Mmm. Alright, so Ty, what'd you get? Enchilada. Got an enchilada, what'd you get? Taco. Me and Kale both got an album. He got one for $6 he's never seen before. I got uh, Mika Levi's Blue. 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 Mika Levi's Blue Alibi, or I think it was called Blue Shit. I don't remember the name of it. But, yeah. Um, we'll end up showing them off at the end of the video. We're gonna go into two more record stores, and then a thrift store, and then we'll wrap it up. It's currently four o'clock, and it's already dark outside. So, 
Subscribe to Quad Tug. Isn't that right, Ty? Subscribe to Quad Tug. Hey. He got the JPEG Mafia. <laughs> I can't believe it, dude. <laughs> I can't believe this one. This one's like a crazy time. Oh yeah, we didn't vlog the. We went to an, uh, another we one. Just, we went to uh, Zionsgate. Yeah. Zionsgate. I really like that place. Yeah, Zionsgate. I, I said I was gonna film it and then I forgot to. <laughs> so that place, I really like that place. Yeah, that place is really cool. Yeah. I, didn't get, I, didn't right really, I didn't get. I didn't get. I didn't see that. What do you mean? I don't know how I didn't see this. Oh, we Dude, tired. what the hell? We got the yeah. odd future tape here, bro. And they got this. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I think that I probably should. Kanye oh, Wall for the Yeah. Oh you give us like your missing out of the out of the first store we missed. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> right, yeah, but that's, that's my find. Three pig mouth, yeah. Look at that. Oh, Ken wants to show up, what you got? I got a little bit of a jungle. Flex. Got some jungle breaks. Me in the jungle. Where did you get Ty? Uh, this, isn't, this isn't at this store, this is at Zion's Gate. This is at Zion's Gate, yeah. We ran out of money. <laughs> no! <laughs> CFC, CD. CFC, CD. <laughs> no, no. Have a little... The sticker is gone. That thing disappeared. No, oh, right there. A little racing. Let's have a little rating. <laughs> and what else did you get, Cal? Huh? Did you have anything that you got? Oh, I already showed it off. But he pulled. Yeah. No, he didn't. Oh, yeah, six, this. A $6 record. So, this one, I don't Keep know what time. it is. I can't read it. No, I, could, I tried switching this up. I didn't get anything from that. I think it's man E poor I don't know. We're gonna do a quick ser Google search. Let's see. Google oh. search. There's Drake, guys. Drake. Look at, guys, look, it's Drake. Can't see it, but it's Drake. Drake UK. But yeah, I found JPEG Mafia. That's the craziest find I've ever had in my entire life. <laughs> Crazy. Welcome to the end of the video. Where are on the end of the video where we show off the albums we got. So Ty is not here with us because he, he died. He's gonna record something. He, we'll put he, it he actually died on the way home. He, he jumped out of the car window. No, I'm kidding. He we had to drop him off because his parents weren't able to pick him up after this, and Kale's parents were. So we, so I'm here. Yep. So we're gonna review our albums. I'll go, then you go, then I'll go, then you go. We'll, get, we'll kind of switch off. Okay. Uh, you wanna go from least to most? Expensive? Um, I'll or go from no least no least excited to find to most excited to find. Okay, let's. I'll, I'll go with I'll go with first with mine with the least excited to find, which I was still super excited to find. I got um yes and self titled album uh, at Silver Platters when we went there. So that's what I got. My sister's behind us right now watching us. But um, <laughs> I, yeah, I got I got yes and vinyl. It's on clear. So that was pretty cool. That was awesome. Here it is. It's on the clear vinyl, and it comes with a little poster too. Oh, the contacts. Yep. Would you like to, to say anything about it? Oh, uh, if you if you're into one of your point memories music or something, I'll check this out. If you're into one of your point memories music, I'd, I'd recommend checking this out because it's kind of similar. Yeah. Yeah, some ambientish stuff. If you like that. Okay. So this is called Jungle Boy Conflicted, and it's literally just I believe just jungle, like two jungle songs that I got for like six dollars, seven dollars. Honestly, I guess because I kind of want to, I want to see if I can sample it or not. Maybe I don't know. It's just like I kind of just wanted to do it. Just wanted to had one of these. I don't know. I never listened to it. You want to do a quick listen? That was at Zeon, so I don't want to get copyrighted, so we'll do that after. We'll, we'll, we'll do a review after this. We'll, we'll have a... Um, we'll, have a well, not this <laughs> one. Not this one. This is, like, short, though. Oh, so you can still do it. Uh, I give us a 10 of 10. Oh. I give this one... Right. I don't know. I'll go next. Also, what store was that from? Yes, it was from. That, oh, yeah, this one was Zion. from... Zion. Zion's Gate. Okay, next up for my, I guess, least thing to find. Um, okay, here we go. This, not least to find. I, I, I'm just going to show them off in order of, like, which ones... I like or something like that. I don't know. I'm just gonna show my off in some kind of order. I don't care what order. Next, I got um, Blue Alibi by Mika Levi. This was at. Wait for you to stop printing in your bag. <laughs> my bad. No, I was, I, was, I was waiting for you to stop. My bad. My bad. 
I'll if stop. you keep using that. No, 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 no. I'll I'll get it. I'll get my thing. Like I'm like I'm thinking. All right. So this is Blue Alibi by Mika Levi. Um, I started listening to this album like recently, and Mika Levi. I I literally reviewed the Mika Chu album on my channel. I gave it a ten out of ten. So. Same artist, I had to get it. Their music is so good. You cannot um, flip it over. I cannot flip it over. There are tits on the other side, so. No thanks. Got this one at Wall of Sound, which we didn't record. We did not record. We did not record. <laughs> we didn't record at Wall of Sound, which um, was kind of sad, because that, that store is really cool. It has like all like electronic stuff. Didn't record there, but I got this from it, so. That was really cool. Okay, so my next thing I got was, I forgot what it was called. I don't know what it's called. I don't even know what this is called. We found... Wall I found... Sound. Huh? Wall of Sound is where you got that one from. Yeah. So, the Wall of Sound. Uh, I mean, Manus is, is there a side label? Manus Manus is there a side label? Is there a side label? I don't know. I don't, think it's a, I don't know what it's called. Wait. The text looks like... It's very hard to read. Speeding across? Or maybe it's, maybe it's a record label. Maybe. I don't know. We, we I don't it. know. We found it. If you know what this album is, then I guess um, we found an album that you like, and we don't know what it is. It was six dollars. Wall of Sound. I, I'm just like I think I don't know. Maybe I'm I'm kind of excited, but like, I I just you know. Well, this is like Neon Pia or something like that. I don't know. I just I thought I saw it and I was like, that's pretty cool. So you you bought it six bucks. All right. Next up, this is the one that I was kind of freaking out over when I saw it. Actually, no, I'll. I'll I'll do the one that I semi freaked out on, which is uh, pretty good. Skid Row by James Ferraro. Now, this one, okay, so we went to, this is at Zeon's, I got this at Zeon's. Um, Zion's, I think, not Zeon's, Zion's. And uh, so, Skid Row is an album that I've been looking for on vinyl, James Ferraro. And I saw it there and uh, almost screamed because I have not been able to find this at any record store. It's on, I can get I could I could have gotten it online, but like the shipping prices are always from the UK, so it ends up being like a hundred dollars, you know the deal. But um, yeah, Skid Row, James Ferraro, love this album, so I had to get it. So Donnie my next City. thing is uh, so I got Donnie and J D Beck as uh, what is this called? What's it called again? Not tight. Not tight. Not tight. Uh, I real I remember when this album came out. I listened to a lot of their covers. Like, but especially the Emma, like when the, the Emma Tomb uh, covers, I started lis like listening to all their stuff. Mostly listen to, I listen to like the the Kenny Beats, uh, yeah, with the uh, Thundercat nice. stream. A lot of Thundercat features on there. So if yeah, you're yeah. Thundercat, then. Thundercat. There's a lot of good features on here. Uh, Thundercat, Mac DeMarco, Herbie Hancock, Anderson Pack. Snoop Dogg, Busta Rhymes, and Kurt Rosenwinkel. Nice. Some really good uh, features on here. I only got vinyl today. I didn't get any CDs. This was this is featured. Uh, this I'm pretty sure it was featured on the front of uh, the uh, what's it called again? <laughs> While you're doing that, I'll go with my next. No, 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 no. Mind, I guess. It'll be quick. Uh, 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 feature on the front of something. Discogs. Discogs. Oh, it was at the, on the page. It was at the front of it. So there's that. All right. Next up, I'm going to go with the one that I, I almost, like, shat myself over, which you probably saw in the video. All my heroes are... All my fucking heroes are cornballs by JPEG Mafia. I... Okay. This is... I'm still excited over it. Didn't, didn't like, change the excitement. This is a bootleg, so this is not an original pressing. But, um... I had not been able to find this album anywhere on a bootleg for a cheap price. 35 bucks for this, and it's on blue vinyl too. 35 bucks for JPEG Mafia's All My Heroes Are Cornballs. It is, it is a bootleg, but I don't care because I literally have been looking for a JPEG Mafia on vinyl for so long. JPEG Mafia album on vinyl for so long. I found one. I don't care. It's a bootleg. Um, but yeah, this was a huge find for me. So awesome is that. So we have the the <laughs> the 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 by, by Tread a Cat. I listened to their uh, so I had like a I listened for a little bit. I listened to a lot of like I like a lot of like Japanese stuff. Japanese rock. Like uh pop like pop city pop mm -hmm. stuff like that. And this is one of the, the albums I listened to at the time. I saw I it, love that and he, so he, he was like, you should get it now. <laughs> yeah, this I was is like, rare. This is rare. And I was I like, think, honestly, I, I was like, crash. sure, I'll get it. 
So, awesome. Yeah. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> awesome. But yeah, that album, I've, I've seen it go for like kind of a lot, but um, if, I mean, I saw it there, I almost, I. Oh I yeah, like, what did I, you got this at the. Uh, Silver Platter, Silver, Silver Platter. Silver yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, what did you get that? Imagine I got this at Spin Cycle, so. Spin Cycle. Spin Cycle. And then you also got something from Spin Cycle. All right, next up, uh, this one is uh, one that I was looking for when we came here. Dean Blunt's uh, Black Metal 2. Now, the whole cover is black except for the 2 and the parental advisory sticker down here. But, um, yeah, I was looking for this one, and there's not much to say about the cover or anything because it's all black, even like down at like, the center labels, I'm pretty sure. But, yeah, I was looking for Black Metal 2. I found it at Silver Platters and picked it up, as well as cool. that Yes And album. And then I picked up another album from Silver Platters that you probably already saw, but... I'm not gonna spoil it for people who just skipped to the end of the video. But yeah, Dean Blunt, Black Metal 2. Fucking love Dean Blunt. Um, I really wish that I could have found Black Metal, the original, or maybe even, um, what's it called? The the one with like, the hands on the cover, I can't remember the name of it right now. But that one's kind of rare, so I didn't really expect to find that. But I got Black Metal 2, so that's good enough for me. And you should do your tape. Show off your tape. Oh. Yeah. Actually. This is really cool. It, it, it's like so. This is not really counting, uh, but I didn't show this off. Yeah, you didn't show that one off. This is loan. Levitate. That was originally. It was actually a uh, Christmas gift. Yeah, Christmas gift for me. And I got Ty. Um, I'll put a picture on the screen of it. I got Ty uh, Destinamic Shroud live from Japan. Another re-gift. It was an album I didn't listen to that much, so I was like, here you go. You can have this. I love breakcore. <laughs> <laughs> That's a kind of a break for them. So there, there you go. I, I almost forgot about that. So. Yeah. There. Next up is the other one I got from Silver Platters. I got The Racer by Tom York. I originally wanted to get Anima. I got, that's what, that was on my list was Anima. But I, I saw The Eraser and I had not seen it at any, any other stores in like the past couple times I went to record stores. So I was like, might as well just pick this baby up. Um, so I did. It has um, The Eraser on it. Got Black Swan, Skip Divided, Atoms for Peace. Yeah, there's some really good tracks on here. Picked it up, had to when I saw it. So yeah, I spent ninety one dollars at Silver Platters. So you guys got good business there. All right, you can go for your next All one. All right, so I got a bootleg at uh, Spin Fox. Cycle. Spin Cycle. It is uh, your uh, arms are my <laughs> your arms are my cocoon. Self titled. This is honestly, I honestly did not care that this is like. A non-official. Yeah, just like I did. I just like I, it you is a little. It. It's a little blurry, but like this cassette honestly looks pretty cool though. Yeah, it is a little blurry. Like the cover is pretty blurry. Here, I'll try to see if the camera. Well, the camera is kind of blurry anyway, so it won't really do anything. That, that looks, is a cool that's a, design though. That's a cool design. Yeah, it's got like meteors or something like that. I've been listening to this album a lot lately, so I was very hyped when I saw it. I kind of skimmed over it and then I went back to like. I could have pointed that out, I'm pretty sure. And I was no. like, oh my god, I'm going to get it anyways. I, w I was grabbing a uh, LCD sound system. This was one I'm excited about. Yeah. I don't even care. Yeah, uh, it's like, like I don't care that the official. JPEG Mafia one's bootleg either. It's fuck. It's like, it's, it's all my hair. Oh my god. I just almost creased the sleeve. I don't care that it's a bootleg. I found it. I love that album. So, yeah. All right, next one from me. This is the last one I got. We got Igloo. There was tape on it. Igloo Ghosts Neo Wax Bloom. Um, I saw it at Easy Street, which I have right here on my shirt. This is the first story we went to. I saw Neo Wax Bloom. Was like, holy shit, um, that's crazy. I'm getting that. Got it. Um, I'm surprised because I, I really wanted to get Young Fathers. I think it was the album Dead, but I, I had that one in my hand. Didn't get it because I was like, this is this is something that I've wanted for a while. But I got it. And. Um, yeah, and then I also had I also had a copy of Tyler Crater's Wolf, but it was also a bootleg for like forty five bucks. Didn't get that because you know I found this. But yeah, Neil Wax Bloom, the blue ghost. So my last sweet. one. And <laughs> record please. All right, that's all my stuff. <laughs> I brought some. This last one is like the big guy. Not duster. That duster. duster. <laughs> Listen. I've been to this airport. I call it the Duster Airport. It's the Seattle Tacoma Airport. Hold up a little higher because I'm pretty sure it's black. It's a little it's black. A lot of, not, it's very, like, this is like the front of the parking lot. Like the and then the back, I don't know, it, but it's just like the back. It's probably just the airport. But it's just interesting, just the 
fact that like I've been there. Yeah, you've you been know? to that cover before. Yeah. It, it, it's a little crazy. I love how there's just like this giant just blue yeah. square. So that's that, so cool that, to me. I don't, that, I don't know why. But that's, that's, so a, cool. that's a kind of theming with the, uh, like, kind of with some of the dustier albums, like Tridosphere. Because yeah. it has. It's like all some minimalistic shit. Yeah. Yeah. Same with um, uh, the, the one that's just like the huge white square. And the vinyl color. Like the vinyl. Oh, yeah, the vinyl color. The color is like, it's crazy. It's I've never seen this kind of pressing before. It's my first time seeing it, so. So this is all the. The, you know, all the stuff that got dropped yeah. on the on the label. Yep. There's the, the one I was talking about. Oh, yeah, the dust. That, that, that one. one. It's just all white except for a little bit of text. The Beatles White Album. It's a reference. Here's the cool CD. Uh, no, not CD. Yeah, look at that. It's, a, it's like, you probably can't see it on the camera, but, like, it looks like eyeballs. It's really cool. So. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, yeah, so I, I got this from EC Street. I also forgot, I got the, the Not Tight from Easy Street, I forgot to say that. Yeah, Not Tight as well, Easy Street. And then this was Spin Cycle, I think you already mentioned that. Spin Cycle for this tape. I already said that. Um, there was also a JPEG Mafia, I think it was Dark Skin Manson, and there was also a Ghost Pop tape, tape there, unofficial, but they had um, tapes of those two albums. I almost got Ghost Pop, but at the same time I was like, well, it's, it's an unofficial pressing, I already bought uh, All My Heroes Are Cornballs. So... Yep, that was our little haul, and then I'll sh I'll put up what Ty got on the screen right now, um, like in text, but yeah, we're gonna go listen to some albums now and have have a, just have a great time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you liked and you want to subscribe. Um, if you want to go to if you live in Seattle near these record stores, go check them out. <laughs> 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 Always go and support a local business, you know what I'm saying? Local business. But yeah, we had a great day. I spent I spent way too much money. I'm probably now gonna go broke. But um, Go <laughs> go to the record label. Yeah, but you know what? It was worth it because I got but I, I'm still hyped over that all my hairs are cornballs. That's like one of the craziest purchases I've ever made in my life. But I can't fit in the sleeve. I can, I can no. He wants to do himself. <laughs> All right, but yeah, like and subscribe if you liked the video. Hope you enjoyed our little haul we got going on here. Um, so yeah, that's it. See you guys later. What if it didn't?